All right, so good morning. Uh, yesterday was supposed to be a team vlog type day, but I legit only have like three clips. I have a clip of me packing my bag to go to the team, modding stuff. I got a clip of me getting dressed to go run. And I got a like a 20 second clip of me eating. So instead of me posting it, posting those as their own video, I'm gonna just add those clips in here somewhere. Just so y'all can get a gist of what we did. But I'm packing to go to the gym right now. <sighs> Cause I woke up later than I been waking up, but today Saturday, you know, today Friday, and we don't have to run or whatever. I mean, we supposed to be running, but I'm not gonna do it. I think I deserve the rest of the weekend off, so I'm not running today, Saturday, or Sunday. Which y'all be like, oh, you gonna take that many days off, man? Listen. My back hurts. My, my, I don't know why my traps are sore as hell. Like, I woke up this morning and like shrug my shoulders to like you know stretch and wake up. Phew. And I I know why they're sore, so I'm not even really mad about it. <laughs> I just haven't they just haven't been this sore in a minute, so it caught me off guard, you know. And also, I'm going to try to do my laundry while I'm at the gym because the gym and the laundry room are right next to each other. So, I'm going to do my laundry and hopefully get it all done before lunch because I don't plan on leaving my room after lunch. I have not played on my game and I haven't played my game in like a week and a half, and I've only been here a week, so I'm going to hop on my game for the rest of the day, yeah, that's what I'm going to do, uh, what am I, gonna, I got my, what's coming, I'm not taking my, my lifting belt today, because I don't plan on going that heavy, because today is supposed to be focused on glutes, hams and calves, but I'll probably just spam, uh, what is it, what they call it, I might just spam back squats, so yeah, <clears throat> spamming back squats today, and calf raises, <clears throat> oof, also, my allergies have been kicking my ass the last two days, my nose, has been running non-stop. I think I got my bag packed. Also, I lost my I lost my uh little cap of car mix yesterday. <coughs> so now I gotta buy some more. But it's whatever. Alright, this is just me getting my concoction ready. Protein creatine and I will usually throw my pre-workout in here also but it throw the taste it throw the, the taste off a little bit and for in my eggs I got this off Amazon but y'all can get it off uh y'all can get off the off the seek website also I just wasn't in, I wasn't specifically looking for Seek, but when I was looking for some uh, protein on Amazon, they popped up and I was like, oh, I've had those people before. So I bought it directly from Amazon or off Amazon. pre-workout it and this is the pre-workout I'm currently using 
bucked up, woke as fuck. That being done, let's get to gym. So y'all, y'all remember how I said that the uh that this weight room is trash, whatever. So I think y'all noticed that I don't use the uh the safety bars on squat, and that's because it's very hard to get them on and off. And I took them off last semester because it made it easier for me to just squat because they'd always have them at the wrong height and also i would use this for bench every now and again which made it way harder because the height for squat and for my bench two very different heights and i feel like if you can't get the weight up and i reason you'd be in here playing with the weight because if you really want to max out, you should be doing it in the comfort of a more updated weight room like the one we have down the road. I'm just not going in there because it's a hassle to text the coach and see what time they're going to be in there and debate on if I want to go all the way down that road. Because like I said, I don't drive. And it's not a long walk. It's just a walk I don't want to make.
So I fucked up. Um, I forgot I was supposed to be giving out a tour today. So all I did was my warm up, which I am sore. I just I am I am sore as heck. But let me go ahead and get changed and go get ready for this tour. And it's like twenty minutes. I said twenty minutes. It's like ten minutes from now. So let me go back up to my room and change out of this shirt so I don't be sweating all day. But yeah. Liz, I, I don't know. Let me get let me get there. Really good speakers. I won't lie. Sometimes some of the speakers are a little long winded, <laughs> um, but most of the time it's pretty decent. And then you get four chapel skips a semester. We have and I think I'm gonna offer this year. And then we also have an athletic trainer in here, so we have two full time athletic trainers. Miss here from 8 a.m. Okay. Uh... We can go to the training room, but I know Misty is walking around currently. So, life is taking an unexpected turn. Not really, there's just so many people in the cafeteria, I can't get another plate of food yet. And my stomach hurts. Um, I gotta, I ain't got a boo-boo, but I might have to let some gas out, but I ain't gonna do it while I'm eating. <sighs> so, um... Things happen now. We're in Walmart. This is originally just supposed to be a, not even a vlog. Ooh, I just broke something. What's it? What? Oh. Uh, what's up, Logan? <laughs> I'm not looking for anything. I just. Oh snap. Some people actually play that they say it's not very good. Yeah, they say the, the gameplay does not match with this with the uh trailer show. Plus I, I I can't even play it. I have a, a digital. Yeah, it, these are actually pretty cheap for Switch games. I have a digital. <laughs> I wish they had uh what is it? They just put Red Dead Redemption 1 back on PlayStation, but it's $50. I didn't even play I didn't even pay that much for the second one. Cuz I got the second one for like less than 30. I got second one for 20 bucks. That's what I'm saying. They gonna I'm like I wouldn't even They didn't add anything to it. They just cuz they took it off of PlayStation and then they uh it's still on Xbox for like $3. And they just released it back on PlayStation 4 and 5 like three days ago. And it's $50, bro. The, the game is like six years old. Now, I understand if they did it for GTA 5 because of all the updates and whatever, but I think I only paid $40 for uh, GTA, which sucks. But it is what it is. I'm going to just buy it for uh, PlayStation. Cause it's not PlayStation or Xbox, cause it's only like ten dollars to buy Red Dead Redemption and Undead Nightmare, cause I only played for Undead Nightmare actually. All right, good afternoon, people. There is no real vlog today, but I'm eating a, a undone burger. It's pretty pink still. But hey, gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> we have two special guests here today, though. We got Ronald. What's up? And we got Cody. How's it going? <laughs> I'm not eating no strawberry honey bun cake. There's diabetes. I barely, I can barely eat one honey bun. Y'all ever ate a, a, a microwave honey bun though? I can eat. I can eat maybe half of one of those before I, I'm ready to fall asleep. That's glazed, though. Yeah. No. Yeah. Like the icing glaze. No. 
No. It got like it got have it got to be clear glazed. If you eat, if you eat, and listen, I mean this in the most respectful way possible. If you eat a iced honey bun, you are a nasty fat fuck. <laughs> that that I tried to eat one of those one day. I I took one bite out and my t- all of my teeth started hurting. I could I I could have sworn I got cavities just from biting into that once. Man, listen, you can y'all can have that. Man, no, those things are disgusting. Make me feel like I'm. Can you microwave those too? Uh-uh. This man, this no, like five seconds. Yeah, it, it, it's too much, man. It's too too much. It's too much sugar. Too much I There's too much everything. I get because that's not the most sugary thing you had. It's not, but I have I have. What's wrong with a moon pie? That ain't not it's the cardboard covered in chocolate. It's not. It's not a cardboard. It's a marshmallow. With a really thin cake I on top, to with I guess a uh, I don't know what that is on top of it. I don't even like marshmallow. I don't like marshmallow, but I, I give me a box of moon pies, boy. Nay. I used to eat them all the time, and then I guess when I got, but you know, it's like once you get older, a lot of stuff starts tasting. Yeah, that's why I don't like uh, what it is, meatloaf. I used to love meatloaf, but my mom made me eat it so much I don't even. Like, hey, hey, a pot roast. I, yeah, I never get over. I never get over that. Like whenever they make the pot roast in there, and it be real salty, fill my plate up. I, I love it. It's basically just a meat, a meat cake with, with ketchup on it. That's why I don't think about it. Yeah. Anything good with pig, 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 tails, don't eat it. Uh, nope, I can't do it. That's probably like hamburgers and hot dogs too. So. Yeah, but I'm not like actual pig feet and pig ears. Yeah. I can tell, if I can look at it and tell that that's the foot of a pig, I ain't eating. Now, you know, we had that, okay, this is going to sound disgusting, but I'm going to say it. Two years ago, it was a random deer ankle on campus. I'm not saying I would have ate that deer ankle, but if I would have went hunting, killed me a deer, and would have had me a smoked deer ankle, I would have walked around. But pig feet? Nah, couldn't do it. But I, I chew on me a deer ankle. I don't think there's enough meat on a deer ankle. That's not the point. It's just like a dog chewing on a bone. I'm chewing on deer ankle. It it, it 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 doesn't have enough meat on it for me to eat it, but it's got enough meat on it for me to chew on it. Yeah, yeah. I live a deer jerky. Yes, that sounds good. Deer jerky, oh, deer I, I chili. Oh, Coach Shepard made some deer chili like uh not last year, but the year before for uh. During the uh, the little the like the little uh week or two we were still on campus uh during track season. Oh, and he made it for the uh for the banquet a couple years ago. And, ooh, I mean, there turn it up. He said, "You like that?" I said, yeah, "It's good." He said, "It's deer chili." I was like, "Okay, as long as it wasn't pig chili, I'm cool." Like I I eat per- I eat pork. But when people start making random dishes with pork, I'm like, bro, what are you doing? That, that jerky that Caddy Mama made, I mean, her daddy made, if that one turkey, what would be it? I think. Uh, Hen- Hen- Probably. Hen- but uh, you, you remember Whittle? Who? Jacob Whittle. Mm-hmm. He was a. Uh, uh, I ain't going to say a super senior because he only came back for the second semester to run track. But his dad. Used to always bring a two gallon bag of deer jerky, and they let me have one of the one of the bags. I was oh my god, I was so happy. But it, when I say he put so much spice on that stuff, I was eating it and drink water at the same time. My mouth was so hot because they had uh he he had uh did it with ghost pepper. I was like, hey man. Daddy, dad, I put his in my 
different like gallon Ziploc bags. And he gave Hannah one of them. He, Katie had one of them. Hunter had one of them. Jake had one of them. And then her mama didn't have one of them. I said, she give you a hug at this point. Man, I'm, hey. Hey. <laughs> I know I talk a lot of shit about my teammates, but their parents always came through. They, their parents, they came through. Deer, deer meat, fucking snacks. Did you have that deer jerky that Mr. Tommy Conley had past you? I don't think so. Man. I ain't gonna put me in cold last year. He added some cheese to his, like on the inside of it. I told him, I said, man, you're going to make me call you my grandpa. Hey, at this point, might as well. You read uh, your sausage? I'm not a big fan That's of sausage. He made. He made sausage. It's, so good. it's much better than normal sausage. It is to me. I'm, I'm sorry, but I'll never eat anything that this chicken's. I can't do it. I ate it once. It was like. I ain't got nothing against it. Because I know everybody was like, oh, you eating, ch- you eating chitlins, you eating chitlins, bro. It ain't, okay, cool. I ate it once, I like, eh, it just ain't for me because, like, the texture, if it is too soft for me, I can't yeah, chew it. Other than that, it, hey, I would eat them if they had, if I could chew them. I do. They're kind of weird to think about. Don't think about it. It's basically just fried pig skin. Just don't think about it. It's a good old crack, man. I ain't gonna lie. Crackers are real crack, too, but they good. I, I was a kid. I, ain't even, I don't even think I had all my gr- oh, grown-up teeth yet. I'm, I am When I say chewing the fuck out of... Whew, I used to always get the uh, barbecue joints. Now they making chicken skin around, too. I don't even like eating chicken skin, so I wouldn't even want those. Mm, they're they're okay, but I don't like the aftertaste. Really, really not. I don't. I like fish skin, but tail. I don't know if they do it like that though. But like on the fish, like tail. Depending on the fish. That's a big ass mosquito. Cody, what the hell are you eating? <laughs> I eat, I eat some kind of weird stuff. I eat the skin on kiwis and mangoes. I. Bro, what? <laughs> Man, <laughs> hey, okay, I wasn't gonna say nothing about the kiwis because some people do that, but mangoes, you know, bro, it's like eating a a a, a dried apple. That do you know how hard you got it? It was it's how thick the uh, mango skin is. Some people swear by orange peel, but I'm never gonna eat an orange peel. Some people say eating the, um, the skin of a lemon is good. I know people that uh they uh make marmalade out of the skin of orange peels. How is a mango weirder like eating the skin of a mango rather than a kiwi? Kiwi is literally furry. I don't like kiwi. I don't it's hard to explain. But you ever tried to peel a mango with your teeth and you yeah. like actually gotta bite into it with a kiwi, it's just like you can just bite into because the skin is like it's so thin. Yeah, but like a good mango, it tastes great, but the skin does. It's actually good, believe it or not. No. You don't have to try it. No, I don't. I'm. Not, I don't have to try anything. <laughs> it's not bad at all. <laughs> I, it's, it's just agree to disagree. I. I I'm not. I'm, there's a lot. There's a lot of things. There's a lot of things I would try. I wouldn't try it. Like an apple skin. Just thicker. Exactly. I don't I don't even like chewing apple skin. Really? I like chewing the skin of an apple either because it feels like uh, it takes it on. Unless it's just a, a green apple. Mm, no, like skin is yellow apples, red apples, I will not chew the skin on them. I will spit it out. I don't even eat red apples anymore. I don't like the taste of them. Ones with like the bumps on the bottom? Like they got the deep, like the steeper curve. It's not really helping. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. It's like when you bite into it, it's kind of like acidic. A red apple? No, but there's like tons of different red apples. 
Well, yeah. Let's say, like, yeah. I don't know if y'all went to the same. Obviously, all schools <laughs> are different. But like, in my school, we had, like, these nasty apples, and they were, like, longer rather than lighter. Bro, it just bit my ankle. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. You had long wait. So it's like they're tall apples, but they were like kind of skinny. That is disgusting. Just to think about it. What school did you go to? <laughs> what was the S one that you went to? Seawater. Seawater. That's from Sheridan. Sheridan. Someone else is from here from Sheridan on our hallway. Yeah, right. Okay. I played football with him. He's in the, the first room. 101. Yeah, why the hell do they have their initials on the door? I didn't want to say anything to him, but <laughs> I looked at it and I was like, I thought it was girly, but I wasn't going to say anything. I've seen the mama putting them on the door. And that's probably why. And I was like, I said, we don't put stuff on our doors out here. We put that shit on the inside of the room if you're going to put them in here. Something my girlfriend would do. I said like, they put the uh they Walking put the, the girls doing, gonna see them all on they, doing. they they put the names on the doors anyways, don't they? They used to, now they don't. Oh. They stopped that last year. Because pretty much everyone kept getting the same room, so they was like, Well, what's the point of putting names back? I, the I, 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 for for the <laughs> last four years I've been had the same room. I've had the same room the past two well, years. Well no, uh past three, because I know my first year I was in one oh eight. And then I was in two twelve, and since my junior, yeah, junior year, I've been in two thirteen. I went from room fourteen on Wilson to room twenty six in Wilson. Then sophomore year, I went to room one twelve. Then junior year, I went from room twenty seven in Wilson to one one o four in Cash. Bro, that mosquito this bit the I'm fuck out of me. My damn ankle itch. And I think next year I'm gonna be on Next year I'm gonna be hopefully grad. I can say hopefully because I am gonna graduate this this year. I don't get, I don't care how. I'm gonna graduate. Get the fuck on ASAP. No Rocky. Uh. Uh, I might start. I might go back during the summer because I pr- I don't want to uh really start working until after I get my master's. <sighs> I'm not gonna say nothing because I got my mic on, but yeah, don't want to say anything incriminating. Yeah. <laughs> It wasn't even going to be incriminating. It was just going to be something very out of pocket. Yeah. Just in case there's a very slim chance that somebody finds my YouTube channel. <laughs> oh. But they won't stop anything. Because they kick me out, they kick me out. And I go about my life. Because I'm not taking anything down that I post. The Bible says not to judge thy neighbor. Don't judge me. Jesus hung out with prostitutes and murderers. It, it's, it's like you can't force Christianity on these kids. Like, if they don't want to be a Christian, they don't want to be a Christian. Or let these kids come here to get their degree. Like, I mean, yes, it's your job to, like, you know, reach out to the ones that need to be reached out to. But it's up to them to accept you. It's not up to you. So once you said what you have to say, you know, like, let them come to find you. Let them find you. And let them find themselves. I think I found myself. But honestly, they don't want to find you. They just want to find 
they try to do that to you because like yes <laughs> i've always been in church yes i'm a preacher's kid but let me find christ on myself like let me find it myself let me come to you don't come to me because me personally i feel like once you come to me i feel like you're targeting me and i'm like i don't like that because I, I feel like you're trying to rush me to be something i'm not Sometimes I just want to tell a, I just want to tell a person, go kill yourself. Like you, you, you try my patience, but I can't do it. I know it's wrong, so I don't say it. I, I think it. I know it's wrong, but me personally, I'm gonna say it every time. I'm gonna let them know. Cause uh, a girl on the chair team, she gonna get it this year. I don't care. <laughs> I'm gonna let him know. She got one time to say something smart to me. Now, I'm gonna let girl, I'm not catching you. Not damn time. Bro, damn. I'm fucking, I got fucking huge ass nut on my fucking ankle. Them skill beat the fuck out of me. I ain't even scratch it though. Uh, I'm gonna fight our coach because she's supposed to be out there. Man, let me poke my head out there and see if she there. Cause I, I'm not, I don't, I'm not gonna finish that burger, but I do want another hot dog. Huh? 